What the fuck? That's better. I feel. I just changed my outfit, I don't... I'm like not really feeling like anything right now, I just like really feel ugly. I can't believe Peyton Royce is pregnant again. I love her and happy for her, but I was really hoping to see her in the ring again. And she had her cute little stint in the indies, and now she's... Her man needs to back it up. What is his issue? He should get pregnant for a minute. How dare he? Billy just popped her baby out, and then Peyton's like, yep, I'm having another one. I was so mad. Like, I'm happy for her, but oh my god, I wanted to see her in the ring so bad. Turn this down. I feel like my ears adjust to the volume as we go over time. This won't take long. You don't like this outfit, Fleetwood Mac? I think he looks sexy. Is it safe to go through here? It's really dark. I'm sure we'll be fine. Come on. Hey, Cloud. Assuming Corneo was telling us the truth, what do you think Shinra's really up to? I mean, They've got to have an end game, but I can't imagine what it is. Destroying a whole chunk of the city just to get back at us doesn't make any kind of sense. Yeah, I can't imagine any way they could profit from it. It's gonna cost them a fortune to rebuild. Corneo's lying. He's gotta be. Guys like him do it all the time out of habit. No. Not that I really want to know either, so. That's a power generator, all right. But they're almost never real, How so. It's an antique. Older than the Mako reactors, even. It'd be a miracle if it still works. Especially this early. Jesse.
I don't think, um, I think we use the term twink too loosely nowadays. <laughs> Do y'all even know what a twink is? <laughs> I've got this. Don't you mean we've got this? Let's finish this. That was like a post on Twitter everybody was talking about. That's never been a command in my chat, Maddie. Let's do this. It's hot. Not bad. I'm just whacking everybody right now. I guess I did wake up on the wrong side of the bed, huh? I got cold for Christmas. And ironically I did because I got a bath bomb and it was like cold. Well, you know, I've made commands in my chat for you guys to figure that out. You know, I put the work in so it's easier access for you guys. But no one seems to care. But it's okay. It won't be tough. Of course not. You're done. I was thinking about getting a drink, but if I drink any alcohol tonight, I'm just gonna get fucking nasty with it. <laughs> yeah. Honda, like, at TwitchCon, one of the only booths at TwitchCon, or whatever the fuck it was, that car company. So stupid. Hi, Joy. We drain it. How do we drain the pipes? <laughs> okay. How do we drain him? Um, put a brown wig on. Um, in a red dress. <laughs> oh, not me describing Lana. <laughs> Aerith is Lana. Is it? Hi, Periwinkle. Honestly, not great. I'm just, like, moody. I'm very hormonal right now, and I could snap at any moment. So, I guess there's that. Womanhood. I woke up some more... And this was the show nominated, also? We won eight Tony Awards. Yes, you did. But you didn't, Leah. <laughs> nope. <laughs> but you didn't, Leah. <laughs> I forgot about that video. Yes, you did. But you didn't, Leah. Yeah, my boobs this morning were very bountiful. They were growing, and I guess with that, I'm just ready to freak the freak out, as they say, as Jesus once said. 
I'm in the holiday cheer. Stream Freak the Freak Out. My favorite Christmas song sung by Jesus. And was the show nominated? No shade to um, Liz Gillis, but did you see that her husband is 50 something and she is 30 something and they got together when she was at a risky age? I did a little search the other day and found that. Yeah, I literally went, oh! Wait a minute. I know this place. Sector 7 should be just on the other side of this waterway. So this is where Sector 6 ends. And where Sector 7 begins. Once we cross over, we can start looking for a way back to the surface. That'd be harder than you think. Well. Let's just try to make our way down this tunnel. Has he died yet? He deserves it. We can do this. Sorry. We'll figure it out. Yeah, for sure. Not even sure who that is, but I'm sure he's getting spooked too. I didn't see your message, and I was like, where is that sound coming from? It won't be tough. Not bad. I want a full legal case that he ends up in prison. Life in prison. Like, have you seen the, like, behind the scenes, like, things of, like, what he would do on set? Like, there was, like, an episode where, like, Jerry or whatever his name is, like, what is his name? The guy that plays Spencer? Like, wasn't, like, dressed yet, and Dan Schneider walked into the dressing room. Like, what? Ew. And was, like, recording it. Jerry Trainer, yeah. Yeah, don't want to make an inappropriate joke, because that's just, like, nasty. Brother, I'm making Trainer. <laughs> Megan the trainer. <laughs> when Wendy said that on her show. Let's do this. Megan the trainer. <laughs> Get him. That's it. Ha. Let's finish it. Uh, this one's for you. Come on. Would kill for a shower. Oh, the close up. Can't I'll keep my hands to myself. I'm protecting myself, you know. <laughs> I still can't believe in reverse 1999 they're making like a soccer skin for one of the hot guys. Also on Genshin they made like a racetrack like outfits for like all of the um like men and women but like the men looked like super hot. It was like oof. Like just it's just my kitty can only take so much. I don't watch sports, but the uniforms in sports are... Ooh! Uh, if you look up on Twitter, Hoyo Fair, H-O-Y-O Fair, F-A-I-R, um, like, all of the characters are, like, dressed up in, like... You're dead. Like, when you, like, that thing when you switch a car, like, a NASCAR, they're dressed up in, like, those outfits, like a pit stop outfit. Like the one RuPaul wears. 
Let's finish this. Like seriously, soccer does something to my panties. And football is just gay AF. You guys are tackling each other in these tight little shorts and you're wearing in the locker room slapping each other's butts. Y'all gay. can't stop thinking about what Corneo said. I know. Me too. It's gotta be a trick. There's no way they'd go that far. But... But what if Corneo really was telling the truth? We have to get there in time to stop it. We have to. Right. Oh, I love watching figure skater TikToks. Huh? That one guy that does all the tricks. Oh, oh. We gotta keep moving. Coming. Oh, I played Roblox fashion whatever the other day, and the category was tennis. And you know I ate that category up. Okay, Aerith. Your turn. On my way. Here we go. Would kill to play tennis in like my adulthood and like the outfits, the fashion, the glamour. We're almost there. Eric! Jump! That was close. Thanks, you saved me. <laughs> Least I could do. Hear that, Cloud? Mm -hmm. Come on. I want to play Crisis Core so I can get to the bottom of Aerith's first love. And plus, I can get a shirtless sack mod if I get it on PC. So, we are thinking long term. Focus. Still thinking about the plate? The future isn't set in stone. That's what I always tell myself. Thanks for the follow. Yeah. I hope you're right. How about this then? Think of something fun. After saving Sector 7, you're gonna... I'm gonna... Go shopping. Topside. I'll buy stuff for the bar. Decorations. Cozy. Sauce. Please. You better. I know we're nasty here, but I just woke up. We need a little bit of decorum. He'll be our pack chocobo. What was that about me? So excited for rebirth. Yeah, same. I'm really excited. I'm playing all the games. Yeah, girl, can you just go to the bathroom for a minute? <laughs> Hi, lame. Have your Christmas went well? I had a pretty good time. I got lots of goodies. Like, um, I got a new, you know, you guys know I love my, um, love my cups. So I got, um, two Mortal Kombat G Fuel cups, which was great, which I'll show you guys when we play Mortal Kombat. And then I got a Playboy, um, they had a Playboy collection at Spencer's. So there's a Playboy, um, shaker cup um and then a uh hoodie i got as well gonna because i have the playboy bra and um yoga pants so i had a really good christmas my mom came over we gave her gifts i went to go see my cousins girl when i i don't want to be petty boots on the fucking vod but like oh my god when i tell you i out gagged my transphobic stepsister. I don't even I don't even care. I can say that to the wind. Like she knows I am not her fan. Like she is not a good person. Like the things she said to me are terrible. Like 
But, like, she was there, and, like, I didn't want to miss out on the holidays with my family. Which, like, she, I, whatever, it's a whole other story. But, like, I walked in. I walked in. Miss Thing was sitting there with her fucking eyeliner all smudged up. I walk in in my fur coat. I have, I have cannolis. I have cannoli dip. I have cupcakes for the kids. I have presents for the kids. I have presents for my aunt. I have presents for their dog. And the, she just sat there, st like, st like, like the flop she is. I out gagged the entire time I was helping all the kids. Like, you know, when the kids are opening their gifts, I made sure to get all of the wrapping paper. I made sure to help the kids bring their stuff to their room. Like, I mean, what was she doing? Wake that up. That's why I tweeted, the best revenge is just to be better. Because it is. It literally is. Like, I know she was so gagged. Get back. I can fight too, you know. No, you know what? I was nice the entire time. Because That's I'm a mature adult. And I, I was not making her uncomfortable. Because there's been so much drama recently that like there's no respect and it's never on my part i've always been respectful to my step family and i even offered her a drink from my present i got gifted vodka and i said would you like me to pour you a drink and i said nice to see you how are you doing i smiled in her face the whole night um because i have decorum and you know what like it's never it's not like she's ever gonna watch the vods she'll never hear what i have to say and honestly like she has said so many things about me over the years that i i i can talk to my community about her bad actions but my mom was like just that was very nice and i was like well yes because i'm a so it's my a person in society that has respect for other people, unlike some other people in our family that are just absolute monsters and say the worst things you could say about a person. I'm not like that. That's really disgusting. I have respect for other people that are in the room with me. That I can be civil at a family party. Not sure some people can say the same. My cousins are getting so old though, I just feel like a fucking grandma, dude. Seeing my I'm little cousins, I'm like, like, I, it's gonna sound weird, but like seeing their faces and like just seeing them grow is like so surreal. Like I, I saw, like I saw their faces when they were like babies, and seeing their like, seeing them like evolve into teenagers and like evolve into like these young adult. Like it's crazy. Like I was changing their diapers. I was like. I was carrying them around the house. I was feeding them. I was like doing like the baby stuff. Like, hello, peekaboo. And now they're like, oh my God, like 11, 12, 13 year olds. I'm like, Jesus fucking Christ, slow down. My God. I, like, I have such big sister syndrome, so it's never been, like, I hate kids. Like, I, I hate the children that are just, like, re rebellious, angry society people. But, like, like, innocent, like, kids that are just, like, trying to grow up around you and need the help. Like, when my, like, siblings were growing up, like... My cousin, my baby cousin, Hunter, like, at 
our last year Christmas party, he was like, "Where, where's Nam? Where's Nam? Like, I want to see Nam. Like, show me Nam. I, I wish he was at this one, because, like, I, I, I looked at all the pictures of us when I was younger, and I was like, wow, I really was a lot of this kid's youth, and I just did not realize it, and he remembers me so fiercely, which really warms my heart. Like, I want to see him again. He lives so far away, which is unfortunate, because, like, I don't want him to forget about me. But I would love to, like, take him to, like, sports games or, like, do whatever he wants to do. Like, if you want to go to GameStop, we'll go to GameStop. You want to do that? Like, I'll be that girl. There must be some way we can lower the water level. I wouldn't do the same for a random child. Like, I have a connection to these children because they're my family, but, you know. Like, there's some snot-nosed kid being a monster. Like, obviously yes, not gonna... This ought to drain the water. No luck? Must be bust. A red light, we can use the. I remember having. All right. Eric, you might. Wait. Trust me, this will be back soon. Girl time. Hey, Rob. So hmm. maybe this is a little different from the one at the bar. More industrial? Here goes. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> Try to stay in sync. <laughs> no. Keep calm. Thanks, Grin. Very after Christmas to you as well. Oh, I was like, like, I don't even see like my youth as like me, honestly. Like right now is like prime me. I mean, honestly, like who sees themselves as the same person like as like the previous years? You know what I mean? You learn and grow, you become a better person, but also like transitioning has been a whole other thing. Like I was always so rebellious and annoying and Jesus Christ, terrible. Oh my god. Try to stay in sync. That went well. Did it? Okay, I'm gonna get this first try. Oh! Okay, definitely not first try. Oh my god, hold on a second. I forgot a key feature in my makeup, but I'm not gonna say it because it's I'm I'm gagged that I forgot I it. it. That's probably why I feel off today. Cloud's probably getting worried. No, there wasn't any tea with my family this year. It was unfortunate. But my my uncle was cracking jokes. He was cracking me the fuck up. It was so funny. But it's so crazy. Like, he raised me and, like, Nicely done. now to see him raise Maybe his kids is, like, so crazy. 
I don't know. Time moves too fast. I'm just so gagged. I have a lot of family too, it's wild. My mom has... This is what you want. Hello? My mom has three sisters. One of them is dead. And then my dad has like 14 sisters. And unfortunately, some of them are alive. Yeah, that's not even an exaggeration. Like, he actually had 14. That's the way to do it. He was one, he was literally the only guy. And then, like, if we have, like, someone that's adopted into the family as one of the brothers, but he's not blood. He's just, like, he was, like, treated like a brother. I'm getting really sleepy. So it's my turn? Good morning, guys. <laughs> Good morning. See ya. I can't. You're done. Sorry. Let's go. Sure is nice to go up for a change. Hope the pillar's not much further. I only have one um, sibling, but I have step family. Unfortunately. You're done. Time to get serious. But it was only me and Shadi. This one's for you. Okay. All good. But like we're all the same me and my cousins are all the same age, so like we all like grew up together as like a Go on. That's that. Like a family. Yeah, Shotzi is my sister. Looks like they're hungry for more. We you really think I'd let my sister walk out on a blue lip? Like she did on that episode of SmackDown? No. Okay. Embarrassing. You too. But there's too many of them. I'm kinda over like Hurry. Oh, never mind, let me not. Bump, bump, bump. Tylio Star. <gasps> this is my favorite chapter. Let's gag it. Understood. The Avalanche mission has been approved. We ought to proceed as planned. <sighs> this is bullshit. What the hell are they thinking? Threats to public order are to be summarily put down. This is what we've always done. Yes, my sibling is not in that era, but that era is terrible. Seeing that, like, happen is just... The rebellious era is horrible. I want to play Tekken 5 so bad. Something about it has been, I've been craving to play it lately. Don't worry, we'll make it in time. <laughs> the best chapter. Let's turn this volume up, honey. Ugh. 
No, it really isn't. My cousin is that right now, and my mother is his foster parent. We could get lost so she had to deal with me and my sibling, and now another one. Sector 7 should be just past that large maintenance facility over there. I vote we stay in the light so we can see where we're going. Dark, dark everywhere. That it? Well, no. It's deserted and kind of creepy. People you also shouldn't say that your account could get banned for saying that. Uh, not just because of the monsters, but because it was of nice the knowing you. What kind? Everyone seems to think that the train graveyard is haunted. Those who lose their way out there in the dark of night will never, ever find their way back home again. <sighs> is that right? I mean, it's not like I think it's true or anything, but you know, it's just... Then let's hurry. No one where Spongebob's like, <gasps> Is it Sasha Banks Day? Oh, that. Not quite. Hello, Marshall. I don't feel very pretty. I feel fucking ugly even in talking about it all stream. Pissing me off. Sasha Colby, so true. Imagine like st like the winner of season sixteen getting the step down from Sasha Colby. Like, that's crazy. I would want to be on this season just for that. Also, everybody, sure rest, rest in peace, Bandit, Drag Race Philippines, Icon. Wait, not Philippines. Was never in doubt. Thailand. Why, like, why does, why does the world take good people and not, like, shady politicians and, like, a terrible, like, exposed people? You know what I mean? It's so, it's like annoying. Guys, what was that? Yeah, the news broke this morning. Uh, oh, don't me like it's that. sad cause like everybody thought she was gonna be on like International All Stars that season coming up, but I guess she was battling health complications. She's, I don't know if that's true or not, but like she's inactive on social, or was. That's that. Too late. So like, I think I just heard. I think it was season one, Did not season two. Too? Why would there be kids out here this late? What? Then. No, not that's um Miss Jade so that's not what we're talking about. It was like the first thing I saw this morning and I was like, no!
Literally. Come on. I'm with you. Let's go. That's it. Enough. Gotcha. I know, I'm like trying to hold back from saying names of who should have de-worded in her place, but I won't. That's that. I'll be a classy girl. Get him. No, you need to relax. You've been on one today. You need to relax. Oh, that would be really cute, game over. That would be really sweet. They should, honestly. At least the first episode. They should do like a tribute. Which I'm, I'm sure they will. I don't even think they've started filming yet, so. Thanks, Shogun. <gasps> By the way, everybody, I am at 50 pity on Navia's banner, probably 60, and she still hasn't come okay. home, so I don't know what the oh, fuck yeah. her think... problem is. Still in one piece here, too. Fucking irritating. Guys? <gasps> Seriously? Come on, huh? Well, that's inviting. Like, I lost my pity and she's still not come home at like 50. Like, I feel like when you lose a pity, it should be a yeah, shorter amount of time. Like, like, going to 90 again is a lot. Like, can we like back it up to like, like 60 being the max and then it's guaranteed you get the character. Like Genshin is so stingy. Well, what oh, does she come out tonight? Oh, she does. Um, I wish everybody good luck okay. on her banner. Huh? Oh wait, that but means Blade is gonna be fine. out for his rerun. Bodyguard, don't forget mine. <sighs> right? Oh, jealous. Ghosts aren't my thing. <sighs> You're just being modest. After you. Mind letting me go then? <laughs> <sighs> He's got all the bitches. And I swiped. I used all my top up bonuses. What more do they want from me? What do they want? Girl, Black Swan, Sparkle, and um, what is his name? The femboy maid. Oh my god, they need to. Genshin needs to stand up. It's hey, like really bad. Can we talk just for a bit? Get back. 
Take it. Oh. <laughs> Let's do this. That's that. It's you. My like hands have been falling asleep a lot lately. It's kind of <laughs> concerning to be in my homegirls. That thing's dangerous. I know, but even so. <sighs> no, he's nice. What the? What the? Gonna need to find another way through. I'm like so irritated. Like I just like feel so ugly. <laughs> like I'm I need to I need to go fix my my hair, my outfit, my everything. Like I'm just getting mad. I don't
Outfit number three. <laughs> oh! I haven't washed my hair, so. I'm doing whatever. We all have bad days, I guess. It's whatever. Can't afford to lose focus. What happened? Oh. Go on. Gotcha. Why is he like on the floor? Get up! about how long these chapters are gonna get towards the end of the game a little bit just a little bit I've watched people play that one. I haven't played it myself. Oh! the cranes up there. I want to I want to get Crisis Core so bad. Because it has a lot of lore in it for this game, so and it's $30 right now. So if anyone wants to add me on Steam and be a sugar daddy for a minute, I like stuttered through saying that because it's you can't say sugar daddy on any website without bots like coming into your like replies. So like I almost censored myself for a second. It's not working. There's I wonder if this is another prank. Someone might be messing with the power supply to make us go to
Um, I guess we're good. I'm very horror model today, so I could freak out at any moment. So everybody needs to keep the queue up. Am I very hormonal every day? Yeah. Am I extra today? A little bit, honestly. I found you. Yeah, today is Kwanzaa. Seven o'clock, so we got a couple more hours of Kwanzaa. All that stuff. Why is he immune? Stop. Gotta be careful. how I went to the final boss by accident. That was literally hilarious. I need to clip that and post it. My dumbass really went to the final boss before the final boss wanted me. <laughs> I watched your vote out of the previous streams when I was gagged. This game really said LGBT rights. No, literally. Well, I saw someone post that was like, yeah, like, I was just like reading like stuff about Crisis Core and this game and everybody was like, yeah, like this was the era where everybody was being femme and like Final Fantasy was like over femulizing all the men in this game. I'm like, first of all, whoever you are on Reddit, like, I need you to go outside and get a job because nobody cares about you. But second of all, make more femme guys. Like, what is wrong with that? They were talking about it like it was a bad thing. I was like... I almost just said something nasty, but I'll just internalize that, but. Do you think there's more in here? Mm. Looks like. Aha! Found you! I need to get more hair products. Look at how, like, I feel like my hair is like kind of healthy but i'm just not putting the right hair products in it it's also really long like this isn't kind of straight i want it to be longer though it's getting it's getting there door on the other side of this place. I think our only choice may be to find another route.
I just went. I just. I just. I miss that era! Subspace Emissary, iconic. We should replay it. I'm just not feeling it today, you guys. I am so sorry. I just end stream and say, fuck it. I'm so not feeling it. Post Quismos. <laughs> Not having a great mental day on the live, I guess. But you know, it's whatever. I'll be fine. My face just twitched. So, I don't have time for your shit. Oh. Sorry. Go on. Yeah, 
Yes, it is a mod. Need a light. That's it. There. You're done. Beautiful music. <laughs> We did it, John. We did it. That was fun. All this time, you were waiting for someone to come and play with you. Hmm. What are you talking about? <sighs> come on, let's get back to the crane. who lose their way out there in the dark of night will never, ever find their way back home again. What do you guys think would have happened if they caught us? I wonder. Maybe they're the ones who were caught. Can we just drop the hole? What if they're trapped here and can't leave? My favorite area, but yeah, like the backtracking and stuff is just a little ridiculous. Just like we hoped. What a relief. We should be able to get through now. Let's find out. <laughs> like now I don't. Where do I go? Let's head outside. Huh? Wait. 
home. Uh, a girl? Marlene? Not them playing tricks on her. The kids that the Black Wind carries away have to live in the train graveyard forever and ever. So you have to stay far, far away from there. All right then, I will. Oh, you know Betty? Yesterday she went with her daddy to to When is daddy coming back? Actually, he might not make it home tonight. Marlene, what are you? We can't waste any more time here. Well, you were the one about? tripping about a ghost, Nothing girl. To worry about. <laughs> Let's get going. I don't either, honestly. But also, like... They never, like, do anything with that storyline. I mean, I know we have two more games to get through, but... It's interesting they introduced that storyline and do like barely anything, any crumbs with it in this game. Oh, it's moving. Maybe now we can get to the other side. Focus. Flock off. See ya. It's over. That's that. Gotta win at all costs. Running, running. So long. Why am I getting pushed around? Let's finish this. That's it. Gotcha. This one's for you. Now you're in for it. Come on. One more shot. Get him. I'll take care of you. Gotta be careful. Sorry. That's it. Need a light. Ah! Yeah. This one's for you. Yeah. I wonder what this looked like in the original game. Time to like burn. the ghosts and stuff. Now I'm interested. This path is blocked too, but we're so close, I can see it. Uh, hey, do you think these trains might still run? Could give it a try. Hi, Lesh Grom. Very hormonal today. Like I could snap at any moment, but. Everybody good? Yeah. Huh? Hmm? Uh, I think that's... Flight separation code is... <laughs> Got it. Yeah, yeah, of course I do. We can drop the damn thing whenever. Except that... You got it. 
death wish or something? Because I sure as shit don't. Yeah. What's happening? Do we have a problem? Not really. Small arms fire from some local boys trying to defend the pillow. <laughs> More would be heroes, huh? Sending reinforcements. The more players that take the stage, the better. So that's what we are. Contact me when the mission is complete. Him with his shirt off. Tifa. They won't if Barrett and the others have anything to say about it. All we can do now is keep moving. I was about to say, why are we even out here? But then it was like the honeybee in like thing. I was like, why did we even leave the sector? But I still didn't realize this is happening in this chapter. I thought it was later in the game, but whatever. We're going the right way. Yeah. Why am I not surprised? They're gonna drop the plates. We have to do something. Yeah, I did. Um. Yeah. I don't really know what to say. Like, I'm like, um, I outgagged my troublesome step family, so that's all I really care about. I work like freelance, like unstable job, and I have more of a sustainable future than most of them, so it's kind of hilarious. And they like want to dog me for my lifestyle. It's like, what are you doing? You know? It's like, just, I love being better than people. Like, you don't even have to say words. I just, like, know I am, so. You're done. In terms of my staff, like, I don't think I'm better than most people, but, you know. Better than them. That it? Merry belated Christmas, Freya. the right way. We'll say Navia still has not come home, by the way. I swiped on my $20 top-up bonus to get a 10 pull, and she is now at 50 to 60. Still not home. Let's go. Fuck Mahoyo. Um... So my agenda is get her. I've been farming for her artifacts. Um, then the agenda is this crisis core, which I would really like to purchase. I need to go get like a steam gift card. I like the store. Um, and then I need to save up for Sparkle in Honkai. Why am I lost? And then I need to save up for Cloud Retainer in Genshin. There's no way I'm passing on the Bayonetta of Genshin after the Princess Peach of Genshin. Like, 
you gotta be joking. Like, why would I pass up on either of them, you know? Almost there. Come on. Great. Love Borderlands. I also had the urge the other day too. The kids that the Black Wind carries away have to live in the train graveyard forever and ever. <sighs> the ghosts are so cute though, you can't even hate. You're just trying to help, aren't you? <sighs> no, the choices don't matter in this game. There's no even choices to be made. Borderlands is a Christmas game? What? You think so? You... You're the one who... Shut Me up. Too. Bitches are annoying. There's a reason Thank why you're you. dead. Oh. <laughs> no way. We found you. Uh, you got me. Hey, where's Aerith? I'm ready. And they never found her. I'm ready. Why would you say that? Why would you compare Aerith to Viola in any frequency? Like, why would you say that? Like, in what way? Like, in what way? Aerith. DPMO, don't piss me off. Dead girl. She needs to kick it instead of Bandana. Come on. The way I censored that name and we still talk about her, there was a reason why I censored it. Never escaping the... Like, do I even want to stream Bayonetta on New Year's? Because everybody's just going to mention Viola and it's going to piss me off. Don't piss me off. Come on. 
team seizing the opening. Enough. Come on. It's so long. They're gonna revive her like John. Tifa's damage is whack. I guess she does damage fast, but... I saw someone on the Let TL like say it's a red flag if you didn't think the Bayonetta 3 story is good. What about what? What? Did we play the same game? Time Bring it. Serious. One more shot. It's literally. When I tell you. People on the internet just say things that they don't mean to get engagement because they have nothing else to do with their lives. Especially on Twitter. People just say an unpopular opinion because they think that they can get some frequency because they're fucking, they have no more content to post. So they're like, I'm gonna make this post real quick. Like, okay, you're unpopular. Like you. Like liking Harley Quinn's new design. The half and half lip with the smudgy purple. I don't give a fuck what you think or if you think it looks good. It doesn't. You're out of luck. <laughs> and that's just the truth of the matter. Honestly, the truth hurts. This one's for you. That's it. Yeah, and then it doesn't even match her hair. The half blue and half whatever. And then it doesn't match her eyeshadow. Like what? What straight man was in the makeup room and said, oh yeah, I got, I got I have this makeup. Like what? Like, it's... Honestly, New Year's resolution is literally not giving a fuck anymore. Like, if someone's stupid on... Tri there was some... Oh, my God. It gets me hot thinking about it because they're probably watching my YouTube videos being a weirdo. But, like, there's this one... There are a couple people on Twitter that are always in my replies or in my, like, Twitter, whatever. And I only called that one recently. So, like, everybody's on thin eyes. Like, if you, like... If this... if. If you're weird and whack, just posting some weird things in my replies and trying to fight, next year, w January 1st, we're gonna beef if you're weird about it. I'm tired of being nice. You guys thought I was a bitch before? Oh, mama. You thought I was brutally honest before? 
I mean, actually, though, just, uh, you know, what just makes me mad is when people post unpopular opinions, but I just said it like unpopular opinions just to be like, cool. They're like unpopular opinion, but I like this character because they're not liked by most people. And I just think that's like really quirky. Shut the fuck up. No one cares. Nobody wants to know, like, and you don't really feel that way. You're just saying that for some, like, analytics. Prime example, I saw somebody on the TL talking about how they love Millie from the new season of Total Drama, and they were like, anyone that doesn't like Millie is fat phobic and, like, just problematic AF, and it's a red flag. She is written in the new seasons if you haven't seen them, spoiler, to be a terrible person. She lies to her best friend and writes a burn book about her best friend and doesn't follow the challenges that she's her best friend is trying to give her advice on to win. Then she doesn't fix that behavior for the second season and goes on to almost kill somebody. Not only that, but doesn't help her best friend by listening to them again. She's written to annoy us as viewers so it's not really a red flag it's just you know watching the show with eyes and ears <laughs> same thing with that person that said the bayonetta 2 thing or bayonetta viola story bullshit like i can't it's like so tired and then like Farina and Nuvalet shippers don't even get me started like you're just a fucking weird pedophile like sorry like I I don't care if they're the same age it's weird don't care you can never change my I don't care I don't care you want to ship Nahida and like real Thiesley next because you're a fucking freak It was annoying, Rob. It was so, and then like people being like, I love Millie, and if you don't, you're fat phobic. Well, no. She's just written to be annoying. So I'm doing as I'm told. No escape. They're ridiculous. Never again. Like, fandoms are the worst, honestly. They really are. They, like, ruin everything. Gotta be careful. Like, Owen stands. I'm getting recommended Owen fan cams on my Twitter. Like, it makes me literally want to jump off a bridge. Unpopular opinion, but Owen was robbed. Well, he made like top three every season because it was rigged for him. So, what do you want? I don't understand why I'm like struggling in this fight right now. Brace yourself. Stay strong, okay? Can you stop doing that? Like, enough. Give me your best shot. Bird. Just hang in there. 
I, I literally don't understand what's happening. Any last words? Go on. Gotcha. There. Bring it on. No escape. I can't, I will never forget the day I posted that Beth from Total Drama is a bad character and I got like death threats. I was like, you guys probably look like Beth in real life. She's so, I just. Bird. Pay attention, I won't give up. Get him. I have an oomphie that actually likes Beth, and anytime I post about her, they like try to defend her, and I'm like, don't even. Like, I will break the mutual right now. Now you're in for it. Gotta be careful. No escape. That's how I got the director of Total Drama to follow me. I literally like screamed him at him when I was rewatching Total Drama action about Lindsay. Come on. And he was like, I think this is the start of a new friendship. If that, if I ever get to voice the total drama character, it's gonna be so gaggy. No, lit it, mind you, mind you, and all these people always send death threats to a real person while they're fighting over a fictional character. Like we can debate on a fictional character because they're not real. Let's not bring real people's appearances and like real people like, why like why are you like oh you need to d word oh you're this and that oh you're fat oh you're the, like we can debate over a fictional character like it's they're not their feelings aren't gonna get hurt. Need a light. Finally, Jesus Christ. Everybody do your ultimates. Don't stop now. Strike hard and fast. This one's Ready or not, here I come. I've Bless got them. this. Hold on, guys. We're coming. And you can go to hell. Oh. <laughs> Let's go. Right. Right. <laughs> For Demacia. Mm Hi, -hmm. hey, Mocha. It's that ghost. Well, yeah, girl. No shit. Corny was great every season. So long. Underrated. She should have won almost every season she was on. I'm gonna be real. She should have. She was robbed unfairly every season. Can you believe that? The first season she got voted out because Harold rigged the votes. The second season she didn't get on the cast and then got voted out when Owen got rigged into the season, which was ridiculous. Because she was supposed to make, she was definitely supposed to make the finale after Lindsay wasn't supposed to. And then they rigged Owen in for no reason. Um, and then in World Tour, she got eliminated in a double elimination when she would have won the challenge because she beat Gwen in one of the challenges for the elimination tie. Again, yeah, she beat Gwen, and it was her and Blainley, and then they were like, actually, we're gonna eliminate both of you. So, she's never had a fair shot at the title. And then in All Stars, we don't even talk about it. It should have been, like, the fuck, that Mike guy or whatever, that, there's only two casts to me that matter, and it's literally the original cast and this new gen cast. There's no other cast I give a shit about. No other cast. Come 
Yeah, I mean, obviously, Heather was supposed to win that season, but, like, still, Courtney's never had, like, a fair elimination. Stand down and surrender to public security immediately. Shinra does not negotiate with terrorists. Resist and we will use lethal force. I repeat, Shinra does not negotiate with terrorists. Resist and we will use lethal force. Got your lethal force right here, asshole! Stop! I said stop! Drop the weapon now! Screw you, you fascist prick! Dropping a whole plate, just like that. No, no way. Tifa! The way she glitched out a little, did you see the way she ran? Hold on, I gotta go to the bathroom. What's up, bitches? Bitches. Oh, yes. I almost just choked on my pill, my tea girl pill. No big deal. Idiot sandwich. Cloud, Tifa, we have to get past whatever it takes. Right. Go on. That's it. Time to burn. 
Oh my god, I just fucking cracked my jaw so bad. Hi, be gross. Oh my god, that hurts so bad. That's that. So long. Very good. Anybody else taste blood? Brace yourself. Calling fire. Get him. Let's do this. What is wrong with this thing? One more shot. This one's for you. Enough. No escape. Let's finish this. That's it. Well, yes. Go on. Oh, wait. No, I should wait till tomorrow. Yeah, I'll wait till tomorrow, because I'm not gonna stream tomorrow. I was like, I should order food, but I'll do it tomorrow. There's a place like up the road that has like really good spicy fries that I've been kind of craving. I'll smoke weed like maybe once a year. I would. This one's for you. Any last words? It'd be nice. Like if I was on vacation, I would love it. But like. When I take an edible or I do There's like I many. smoke weed, I'm like the next like couple days. I know it sounds crazy, but I'm like, okay, today I'm gonna smoke weed. Tomorrow is the aftermath. It's like very serious to me. Aerith? Come on. It like doesn't sit well in my body like usually either. I also always like freak out. I'm like, I freak out because I'm, I feel high because I'm high. I'm like, oh! What you got? Come on! And it's usually never like, I don't like smoke or do a lot. That's Barrett. Well, there's the infamous story that I smoked too much that I shaved cow prints into my leg hair while I was communicating to Marshall that I couldn't see 
but it was just because I was wearing my glasses, but I thought my eyes were fogging up like okay? I was going to go blind. It's Shenra. They're trying to take out the pillar. I know. I have to go back. Barrett and the others are still... Stop. Stay with Wedge. I'm going up. Sir. I'm going to. I can still fight. D'Angelo, thank you for three months of subscription. Welcome in. Let Cloud handle it. Don't worry, I'll patch him up. It wasn't even that serious. You always go, there's definitely something. Hey, as you as if you aren't like high off your ass at every day. Don't even drag me. Wedge, listen to me. You stay here with them. I I could not do like <laughs> In public, I would freak. I would freak the freak out. That happened to me in high school. I remember smoking somebody's weed at like a club, and the next three days I was in bed and I couldn't move. I was like, ah. There was this really good, like blunt I smoked with my friends that I I wish I could find the strain because I would smoke that every day of my life if I could but um, like we just sat down and watched Batman movies and smoked weed and ate cookies it was it was lovely I think it was from a dispensary, but I wish I could go back and get it. I felt so good. I like, I honestly love having the munchies. <laughs> like I would smoke a blunt right now to get the munchies if I could. I love being ravenous. Just fucking a monster no in the kitchen. <laughs> fucking monster for food. Fucking Kirby in a slur, like gobbling that shit down. I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. That's that. <laughs> Nothing to it. I've got a lovely bunch of coconuts. I don't know, girl. Really have no, I wish I did. I would smoke it every day for the rest of my life if I could. It was like five years ago, so there's no finding it. Hi, Karu. Hi, Necro. Biggs. Thanks for 43 months. Hiya. You made it. No. He's not dead, by the way. Everybody thinks he dies here, but he's literally in the next game, so it's fine. It's okay. Don't worry. He'll bounce back. That's good to hear. Could have used some extra padding myself. <coughs> Don't talk. It's pretty bad up there. Cloud. Probably. My uncle got me a giant <laughs> thing of... Uh, I could show you it. It is ridiculously... Still got some fight left in me. Enough for another platoon or two. Splatoon two. Soldier to make a difference. Do you guys think Rio Thiesley is the hottest man in Genshin? I think he is. Sorry, very off topic, but. In the sector five slums. 
My likes on Twitter are just yaoi of him. <laughs> You'll have to do yourself. Let me guess. Not a fan of kids. No. But you have so much in common. My recommended post across all social media is just yaoi everywhere. I love it. I love it. Oh, I love Ito. He needs to be bulked up, though. They need to give him, like, the body of Al Haitham and Ryothis Lee. Like, why does he... He's like a twink with, like, abs. When he should be beefier. This isn't over. <clears throat> he's not dead. He's not dead. Okay, you know what? I'll just leave then if you really don't want to fight me. It's okay. I feel like he's struggling over there. This sad music. I won't give up. Not looking good. Don't give up except for power of friendship. Okay, can you guys please? You're mine. Let's do this. Playing on beginner mode, by the way, and I'm like fighting for my life. Going in. Let's do this. your evil plans to destroy the pillar but the turks uh, but shinra that's us won't let you get away with it i want to so play Baldur's gate but i want to like wait out. for i don't even know like i've played it a couple times but i need to like go through all the mods there are so many mods bitch it's it's crazy Clearly he does, because he's running. Not good. <sighs> Throw down your weapon and surrender. Shinra does not negotiate with terrorists. play Get down Oh she gagged that Thank you That was a close
close one. Unrelated to the current situation we're watching, um, much better, thanks. I'm currently watching season 13 of Survivor. It's Parvati's first season, and um, I'm sorry, I can't stay here. I have uh, to help them. What is that guy's name? Ollie. Yeah. I'll... Follow your heart. Whatever his name is. He's like really good at challenges. It's their first season, like ever. Aaron, and there's a they go to tribal to council, seven, right? Can you guys shut to... up for a second? They go to tribal council, right? And the tribes right now are four people on one tribe and the tribal council tribe. Um, um they have seven people on it. So they go to tribal council and they have to vote someone off so it's gonna be six people, right? But they bring this bottle and it's like, you're supposed to open it after the vote. Bitch, when I tell you I gag, they go, they say, open the bottle. And everybody's like, we think it's gonna be a merge. We're gonna be like, it's like, there's gonna be no more tribes or whatever. And then they open the bottle and it reads, you just voted somebody out. Now you have to vote somebody else out. I went, ooh! I literally audibly gasped. I was in the room by myself. I literally was like, oh! I was like, damn. They ate that. Like, Survivor's twists are so good. Like, every other reality TV show wishes. Merry Boxing Day, y'all. Them, you look stunning. And Buzz, Maddie, you are a goddess. Well, I think I deserve a little more commotion than Maddie. Maddie's over there just finger bang in a snack pack. Get Marlene to safety, right? It's okay. I'll find her. Huh? Oh yeah, hundred percent. Can you take her to the bar for me, Wedge? Consider it done. Now get up there and kick Shinra's ass. Come on. Seventh heaven is this way. Wedge, wait. You guys can't see Oh, Aerith game play. Come on, hey, come on. Go. How else are we supposed to get to War Market? Sir, you need uh, to step away from the gate. <laughs> you have to open the Thanks. gate. If you don't let these people through, back off. Inks. It's not gonna happen. Wedge. I have eggnog in the room. In the other room, I'm I could no eat. Good. Not to anyone up there or down here. <sighs> That's not true, Wedge. Don't give up hope yet. We could still save a lot of lives. You don't think we're gonna stop them from dropping the plate, do you? No. I want to believe that we could still win somehow. Well, then we need to evacuate but everybody, honey. Something in my gut tells me. Or do for a reckoning. Just this feeling. You know what I mean? Yeah. I do. But no one said you weren't. That's no excuse to give up. I don't want to look back one day and wish I'd done it. I'm just saying I'm the girl on right camera right now with right a lot here. of makeup on my face. I need to know I did everything I could. Uh. <sighs> I'm not sure what's gonna happen next. But I am sure I don't want to regret the choices I make tonight. Who said that? Our lives are in your hands. If you don't open up, we're all gonna die. <clears throat> My boobs look really good this morning, by the way. <sighs> Hi, safety. Close it. No, sir. I will not obey that order. I woke up this morning and my fucking, my one titty was enormous. Like not even being dramatic. I literally was like, oh. Seventh heaven is just down this road, isn't it? Head straight and look right. You can't miss it. Don't worry about me. All right, I'll get these people to safety. Get out of sector seven, please. We need to get as far away from sector seven as possible right now. Go to sector five or six. Anywhere but you 
Aerith is literally Katniss Everdeen right now. This is Katniss Everdeen boots. Do you know what's going on? What do they want with the pillar? Well, there's still time, but they're going to drop the plate on us. Yes. Those sons of bitches. What good do they think that'll do? Feel free to cry about it later. Right now, we need to get everyone to safety. Wait, the watch should clear the roads first. Ah, good thinking. Up to it. The safety. <gasps> Avalanche, I take it? Just a friend. Tell Tifa to lay low. We'll take care of things here. That wig is wigging. Mm -hmm. I want that wig. That gray wig. I've got to get to seventh heaven. <sighs> That's it. Oh God, look out! <gasps> oh no! Look out! It's gonna crash! <sighs> Why would you watch the helicopter falling? Why they just see Aerith over there, like on the ground, and go, "Oh, Marlene. nobody wants to help her." Oh no! Need to find another way to get there. Damn it! How the hell did they expect us to escape? There's a way out over there. Gotta get through. Gotta find a way. This underground passage will take you to Walmart. Finally. Hold on. Go, go, go! Oh, you poor thing. Oh, that was the girl with the cats. I know it must hurt, but you've got to be brave now, okay? Come on, keep moving this way. Hey. I'll take you to her. Ready? Mm-hmm. <laughs> Almost Damn there. My leg. No, she doesn't. None of this makes any sense. No need to rush. It's just an outfit. Thank God the kids made it out in time. Come on, I'll we've got to go too. Don't worry about me. We need to get as far away from here as we can. We just have to work together. Get to Wall Market now. It's too dangerous here. This way. Quickly now. Keep moving. Can you take care of her? Of course. Betty, I've been looking everywhere for you. Daddy! <laughs> You'll be fine. Stop! That way's already. Why Please, is this happening? I need to get through. This is it. Isn't it a fire? <laughs> that kid winning the IDGF war, he's I'll literally walking around with the fire around him. No, it's not worth it. One more bird lost. Probably for the best. After all. Hmm. Change of plans. You can take it from here. Someone's been a little too adventurous. Aerith girl, wake up! Get a job. Stay away from her. Please be okay. Hold on, Marlene. I'm 
coming for you. You're Marlene, right? Who... who are you? I'm... a friend of Tifa's. <laughs> um, where is she? Right now, she's with Cloud and the others. Daddy too? You mean Barrett? Yep, he's there too. Wait, Daddy's not coming home? Not yet. That's why I came to find you. Tifa asked me to. She said, take care of Marlene. Uh, the thing is, this place isn't safe now. I'm gonna take you somewhere safer, okay? Are they gonna destroy the bar? Are they gonna destroy our house? Poor girl. I know it's hard. Just remember, you still have your daddy. You can build a new home together, anywhere. I'm gonna ignore Shall the subliminal go? messaging on how I had a house fire this year, and then this scene hits so much different. But, uh, you know. We'll edit that out. I hope you remember it. Come on. Tell you what, we'll grow lots of flowers at your new house. Do you think that I can help too? Of course you can. Hey, what's your... on a merry chase, Aerith. Song. Nemi kiss, Nemi kiss, Nemi kiss. Victoria, thank you so much for the subscription. I appreciate you. Before you say another word, know that your options are limited. There's nothing to be scared of, okay? They have like no mods for the hot guys in this. I mean, like they have like some for the hot, like the main cast, the but these guys, I'm like, I want, I want more shirtless mods for them. The nail. Okay. You ate that. Gotta move. Well, sort of, kind of. Like, I want a shirtless mod for Pitbull over here. Too 
starts with one shitload of bullets. Hey! They should have kissed right there. You explain yourself, partner? Where's Eric? I sent her to Seventh Heaven to get Marlino. In Wedge? I asked him to show her. Ah! Right. Okay. We can still stop. Brace yourself. Right? Going yeah. in. That's that. Then let's keep ah! going. And where do you think you're going? You're done. Well, if this is how you want to play, fine by me. Tough, but doable. Sure. Let's finish this. Keep it together. I got this. Like, I haven't been able to buy a new weapon or upgrades in so long. <laughs> like, it's bad for us. Such a weird mechanic. I don't know. Like, it obviously makes sense, but like, for every weapon having to do this, if you get a new weapon, it's like, what? It just, like, why even do weapons? Just have us have one weapon the entire game, I guess. I don't know. You still want some more? Give me a break. Here we go. It's Nothing's gonna stop me. Come on. Going in. Enough. 
Can't Let's reach it. It's too high. Come on. What's up, guy? Save us all some time and give up. It's a mod. What was that? So, how'd you guys rate my latest and greatest design? Eleven out of ten. Oh, here she goes. Anyway, is she dead yet? Stay sharp. You don't need to tell me twice. Gotcha. <laughs> Back off. Looks like you guys are having the time of your life. Like, what did she mean by the Hillary Clinton thing? <laughs> It literally it makes me itch bowl. That video. Talk isn't cheap. But anyway, we may need to intervene personally. Whatever you say, partner. Keep them busy, will ya? Time to burn. Oh, he was gagged. Calling fire. That's that. Enough. <laughs> and it is what it is. It is so. Can we play it? It is so knowledgeable and so important to life itself. It's talking. But what happens when the talk isn't cheap? And it is what it is. Well, what I mean by this is Hillary Clinton. Man, I wouldn't want to be in her shoes after this. <laughs> <laughs> the, sh the way she looks at the camera. That gif gets me. I, I thought the gif was so funny before seeing the original video and then hearing the original video is so much funnier. Hillary Clinton, I wouldn't want to be in sh her shoes right now. You're done. I, li I, it would be so important to society. Like, they would have to have everybody in schools read it if she wrote a book. I'm serious. I'm not even doing it for the bit. But what happens when the talk isn't cheap? And what I mean by this is Hillary Clinton. Let's do this. I wouldn't want to be in her shoes right now. <laughs> You know what she like You're done. invented I like there's no words. 
for how important that message is. Like, she really ate that. I would fall and die. Jesse. <laughs> Celebrate good times. Come on. Do do do. Do, 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 do. Celebrate good times. I've never liked this girl. Second playthrough, still don't like her. So, you're the guy who gets to hear my last words. <sighs> and what I mean by this is, Jessie, I wouldn't want to be in asked. her shoes right now it's okay cloud it's okay they were my bombs they were all my victims i had it coming thank god my hero so gentle just try to hang on Still not putting up with her BS as she dies. Yes, we won. I, I just wish that I could have had you over again. Everyone with mom's cooking. Girl, you robbed your dying dad in a hospital bed and had someone up. You know what? I won't go there with you. I'll be classy. Yeah, Biggs and her are in the rebirth trailer, so it's like. But I don't think. Oh no. Tifa's crying. Did I say something wrong? Oh, shut up! Corny, 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 corny. Just die. Just die. Just die. Did, did I say something wrong? Shut the fuck up! It's not polite to stare. Oh, here she goes. It's not. It's not. Uh, no one given enough. Jesse. Hey. Unfortunately, she has a pulse, so. We'll learn to deal with it. Anyways. No time to mourn. Not if I have a juicy dumpy. Still alive and kicking? Damn right. Lead man sticks around to the credit roll. No, we gotta keep moving if we wanna make it. That, that like run ready? she did into him was way too yep. personal. She went, oh! <laughs> She wants it bad. She heard there's another girl in the picture and said, let me thrust myself onto Cloud at all times.
Not a lightsaber. That's his rose toy. You. It's something personal, bitch. I thought he was gonna say no time for dick. I was like, oh! Plate separation authorized. Awaiting confirmation. Is everyone just gonna watch him do that? Cloud is literally watching him do that. Yeah, yeah, coming right up. No, you don't. Not when I'm working. Plate separation authorized. Awaiting confirmation. Press it. Almost dead. Oh. So. How'd you get through the way? Had to. No choice, huh? Come Bring on, it. I can't do this without you. Ah! Hello. All set. Good to go. I wouldn't want to be in his shoes right now. I see you're doing whatever the hell you want. <laughs> Guess I'm rubbing off on you. <laughs> Heads up, guys. That all you got? It's on you. Taking over. Run. Keep it together. All right. Watch Whoa. and learn. Oh God. Uh-oh. <gasps> I'm in baby jail. Somebody help Hang Tifa, back. please. That's that. We're out now. Need my help, do you? You got this. Okay, let's go. Going all out. To the 
I was just deal with that. Moaning. Watch and learn. I'm counting on you. It's on you. No escape. Road. Damn it. Oh no, Pipple's dead. Oh, JK. I was planning to join you anyway. Any landing you can walk away from. I'd watch the video. Come on. I was supposed to be in the video. Oh! Take the lead. About damn time. What happens when you mess with the Turks? If you're gonna pick a fight with the Turks. Uh, prepared to leave in a body bag. Mm -hmm. They're close, but it ain't. Hot? Nothing. Help <laughs> Do your thing. Bring it. Bingo. Bring it on. Keep it up. Giving it in there. Watch this. Hold on. And we gagged that. How do we stop it? Wow, your aim sucks. Move! Getting real tired of your shit! Tifa! We're at being useless again. Plate separation initiated. Well, initiated. Commencing separation sequence. Section one separation imminent. Evacuate immediately. Late separation initiated. You son of a bitch! What have you done? Saving his boyfriend. Shooting the thing that is responsible for... Like, th yeah, that's the good I That's a good idea, Barrett. God, I hate Jesse and Barrett so much.
what well, do maybe we, do? we could do something if Barrett didn't shoot it. Nothing. There is nothing you can do now. You can't do this. People. I'm on my own. Eric. Marlene. Yeah, like, why is there, like, a drop the play button? Where are you? I'm at the... Sir, Your activities unwittingly brought you into contact with the ancient, who is now back in our custody where she belongs. For this, I'd like to feel gratitude. Alas, the sector in which you stand has been condemned. Ancient? Run! You have to go now! And where exactly do you expect them to go? Uh, Eric! Uh, uh, Hobo plane separation imminent. Evacuate the area immediately. Uh, How do they get out of those? No, no. Oh! 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 Hey! Over here! Found us a way out! Tifa. I mean, she ran over here to fall to her knees. So true. Come on, come <laughs> the dramatics. On. Oh, the kitties. No idea how big survives that. Oh, a character we will meet in part two. There was also no reason to bomb the place, but it's okay. This is literally Hunger Games. I'm not even being dramatic. That's literally what happens in Hunger Games. That guy even looks like President Snow. I can hear him from a mile away. Hey, here goes. Annoying this? ass. I hate him. <sighs> I wish I could get like more models. Marlene. Could you imagine a Cindy Lou Who Taylor Momsen mod? Ugh. Marlene. Hey, idiot, on the camera, Aerith literally Where? said, you watched the video Jesse! that your child God is fine. God damn you! God damn you all! Uh, 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 uh. 
This fucking dumbass. No fucking nothing's going on upstairs in his brain. His daughter. The girl at the beginning of the game in like the pink dress that looks like the girl from uh Oh, oh I thought that was his butt and she was going. We did this. No. You can't think like that. Whatever came before it was Shinra that pulled the trigger to death. Am I right? Sorry, anything with Barrett bores me. Ah! Anger, okay? <sighs> Barrett. Marlene's fine. Yeah, maybe if he wasn't a dumbass and watched the video, he would know. Barrett. Is that the girl they took? Yes, <laughs> did you see the That's her. Hmm. The hell's going on? I asked Aerith to find Marlene and take her somewhere safe. <sighs> and she did. You sure? Hey, where are you going? I'm gonna reiterate, you saw the video with your own eyes about 10 minutes ago in my dressing room. I can't. Like, he's stupid. Well, maybe they should. Maybe they should. You know what? I don't want a himbo. Himbos are fucking stupid. I never want a himbo. Maybe get some intelligence. I'm supposed to be the bimbo. I don't need some dumbass man. You know what? If you're a man, you shouldn't be fucking stupid. Do something w useful with your life. Don't be a don't be a slab of meat. house. It's in the sector five. Do something. That's where Marlene is. Where we hope she is. Tell me she is. Y'all thirsting over himbos. What the fuck is that himbo gonna do for you? Even if Sit there and twiddle his thumbs and do a crossword puzzle? No, he can't. He can't even eat a bag of Cheerios, right? He's not a good. He's not gonna pour it into the bowl. Like, ugh, just idiot men. Wow, just terrible. Anything about ancients? I know I've heard of them, at least. They come up in planetology books. Meant to be the original stewards of the planet. Could even commune with it, talk to it and stuff. That must be why the Turks wanted her so badly. <laughs> Within my veins flows the blood of ancients. This planet is my birthright. Oh. Nice reference. Hi. You have failed again, I see. The music? Oh! Oh, he's having a, he's having a moment. The way he's whimpering. Oh. Isn't that a blue one? Cloud? Hmm? 
It's nothing. Let's go. It's nothing as he has a breakdown. It's like there's a hole in the sky. Don't you worry. They'll be fine. Everybody well, yes. Whoa, someone forget the Wait. Hey. Over there. What the hell are they doing here? Their jobs, probably. Mm. Just focus on seeing Marlene again. Nothing else. <laughs> Happy holidays. The first thing we need to do is find the place. Where are we going? And sector seven's pretty much destroyed. You guys run into Jesse at the pillar. Yeah, Biggs too. Let they were through, both in it. pretty Let bad shape. But Wedge wasn't up there with them. He got out. For Sephiroth, I hope we're not gonna we're not gonna entertain the himbo thirsting behavior. Come on now, there's no need to be afraid. I've been thinking. You can thirst over bimbos, not himbos. Go what the fuck is a himbo huh? gonna do for you? If we don't look for them, who will? Uh, right. Women just do everything better. I mean, come on, let's Going just talk about it. Let's just talk about it. Right. are still ringing from it. This is Sector 5, right? So where is this place you said Marlene is? Where I think she is. It's a house on the other side of town. Well, come on then. Pick up the pace. I'm going as fast as you are. I can't even imagine my Hi, Victor. I hope so. That's the house. Marlene! Marlene! You can't just walk into somebody's house like that. You're gonna barge through? You don't live here! I hate men. He just barged through Where's the door. Marlene? Is she here? Barrett. Where is the where is the decorum? Oh my god. Sorry, I'm buried. Marlene's my little girl. Lead with that. Yeah. Maybe when you knocked at the door, like someone with class Marlene, and manners. She's got short hair. She's cute as a button, but with the heart of an angel. She was wearing uh pink. She was wearing a she's pink dress today. Upstairs. Huh? Oh. I said she's sleeping. I want to see her too. Come on, let's go look in on her. Keep it down. Don't. Can we go CPS? Marlene, my baby. Thank God. Shh. <laughs> Shinra has my daughter now. I'm sorry. No, I'm the one who asked her to go get Marlene. We'd only just met, but she was so kind and helpful. I took advantage of her. It's not your fault. It was only a matter of time before she ended up back there. <sighs> My arm is so itchy. My because eczema. Is that it? So she told you about that? Well, not really. She must trust you all a great deal. Yes, Aerith is an ancient. 
probably the last one living. She's not my daughter. Not by blood, I mean. If that's what you were wondering. <sighs> About 15 years ago. My husband, he'd been shipped off to fight on the front lines. But then I received a letter saying he'd be home for a bit. So when the day came, I went to the station to meet him. But he didn't come. I couldn't help fearing the worst, even then. But I told myself his leave must have been postponed, that he'd been delayed. Every day I went to wait and to pray. And that's how I met her, her and her mother. I thought maybe they'd run away from Wall Market, or that they were topsiders fallen on hard times. I'd seen that sort of thing a lot. Take Aerith somewhere safe. Those were her mother's dying words. My husband had been away for so long, and I was lonely. So I convinced myself the safest place for the girl was with me. It took no time at all for her to start feeling like family. She was a real chatterbox. She told me strange stories. Like how she and her mother had escaped from some sort of facility. And how she wasn't sad because her mother had just returned to their planet. Their planet, huh? Yeah, that sounds about right. I didn't understand any of it at the time. When I asked if she meant one in the sky, she said no. This one, right here. I the way they try to make us seem like Cloud is the main character, but it's really Aerith. Like, gag it. That's Mother. Mommy, don't be sad. That's what she said to me one day, out of the blue. So I asked her, what's wrong? A man you really, really loved just died. Oh! His heart came a long way to say goodbye. But he couldn't stay because he had to return to the planet. Oh, she was gagged. I didn't believe her, of course. And then, a few days later, I received a letter saying my husband had been killed in action. That's so sad. Things like that, she'd just know. It was a lot to deal with, but we were happy. <laughs> and then came the knock. Letting yourself into a home, they... Aerith. Hey, Cab. You know you're not just any little girl. You're a descendant of the Ancients. I had no idea what he meant, so I said, who are the Ancients? They were the original stewards of the planet, whose boundless knowledge and wisdom shall guide us to the Promised Land. <sighs> Some believe the Promised Land to be a myth. Others, an allegory of sorts. But we take the words of the scriptures at face value and believe it to be quite real. 
I'll show you Which something is why real. Shinra would like very much for Aerith to help You're us. You're wrong. I'm not an ancient. <sighs> but Aerith, even when you're all alone, don't you hear voices whispering secrets? No, never. <clears throat> but all three of us knew that wasn't true. That man knew exactly who Aerith was, where she'd come from, and what she could do. When she slaps him, that would be gaggy. They knew where she was, but they didn't just take her? Doesn't sound like the Turks I know. She had to come willingly, otherwise it wouldn't work, they said. That's why, even if they did take her away, I'm sure she's still being treated like a guest. And that they'll send her straight back home once they get what they need. I doubt it. You're not planning anything, are you? Don't make things worse than they already are. If I lost her too, I don't know if I could, if I could ever. Just don't. Cloud, maybe she's right about this. Maybe they'll let Aerith go when it's all over. Maybe we'd be better off waiting a little while. Let's head back to Sector 7. Got things to take care of. Like checking up on the bar. Well, the bar is like just done for, so. Okay. This is of Starfire from Teen Titans. Aria, thank you. I did like three outfit changes today because I didn't like my outfit, so I appreciate it. Oh yeah, the mom's backstory is really sad. Oh. No, y'all aren't going to make me run all the way back here. Oh, that's not. Oh. The main entrance to Sector 7 is buried under rubble now. So how are we supposed to get back inside? Underground passage in the park. Ah, uh, good plan. But how do we get to the park? I know another way to get there. Aerith good showed morning. me before. <laughs> this ancient girl knows us stuff. Didn't mean anything by it. My heart is still pounding. It was all like shaking. Now I really want to play Crisis Core because we'll get more story on Aerith. I gotta go to like a CVS or something to get a Steam gift card with my cash. The Lord knows when that's gonna be. God, my nose is so fucking irritated from what? Ugh. My ears are still ringing from it. This other one. This kind of thing isn't supposed to happen. Over there. So far, oh my god. Okay, let's go. Gonna finish it quick. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Yeah. Huh. Come on. See ya. Huh. Yeah. Think so. Yeah.
Yeah, I do like the music. A lot. It is a prequel, yeah. So technically there's four games in the series. Crisis Core came out on the PSP or one of the versions of it did. So it's it was remade for PC and PS5 and all that stuff. I'm surprised it's not on like Game Pass or anything. Like or like whatever it's called. Um PlayStation thing. Cause then I would play it because I have that. But, Let's go. I don't know. I just bought a lot of games, so I'm like another thirty dollars. Goddamn! And then like probably gonna have to swipe my card for Cloud Retainer or Navia. Oh, not this again. Oh no, we're good. It's blocked. Ugh. There, that way. We'll have to fight our way through. But it's our only shot. <laughs> oh my god. No problem. <laughs> I just upgraded all of your stuff, Barrett. You better not do one damage. Let's do this. Deal with that. Yeah. I got this. Bring it. Yes. Come on. Hit. Bye. Let's move, move, move. Not so fast. Think you can stop me? <laughs> Going in. <laughs> okay. Let's finish this. <laughs> You're mine. Yeah. And there you have it. Oh, here we go. Let's finish this. Too late. There. You're done. Let's do this. Time to get serious. It's over. Nothing to it. No turning back. Brace yourself. Block off. See ya. I wish I had a Bayonetta cosplay. Sar bad. I would eat. Keep those gloves up. Sure thing, coach. Coach. Okay, let's go. Let's do this. Let me handle this. Bring it. Not bad. And we have to do the DLC. We have to do the UP DLC. So like, we have five freaking games. 
that are like from this franchise. There's the DLC, there's the prequel, there's this, there's the sequel, and then the finale. Sorry. That sucked. Now. Right? <laughs> Isn't it cute? Finally, and like they gave him like kind of like a BBL a little bit. Like, eee! <laughs> Hi Jax, happy to have ya. We had him in um the honeybee in outfit and it was just fishnets and his booty out the other day. I was like, I am on the line of getting in trouble, but let's finish this. It's for educational purposes, so we're fine. If I get demonetized on YouTube, it's no tea. That was pretty damn good, huh? Let's keep it up. Over there. That way out. I'm almost afraid to go back to see it with my own eyes. Tifa. Hello? The way her voice changed, she was like, and the exit's right over there. And then she went, I'm almost scared to go into there. The immediate change up, I'm dead. Oh, I thought we were gonna have to kill these Does people. Does it look like we can go this way? No, there's monsters everywhere. Oh, my hair hurts. Oh, the thighs. I just moaned. Why am I? You're alive. Who is that? Still in one piece. Who else made it out? Oh. I wish I knew. Sorry. Oh, it's fine. I'm just glad you survived. Gives me hope for the others. Hmm. It really doesn't. Like, I haven't brushed it bad. or <sighs> blown dried it. I need to wash it, so. This is like after wearing my hair in a bun for a couple days. Not really giving an F. Oh God, what's what's happening? Why is it saying this? Let me buy some Take potions. Yeah, you see. I know it's not much. Okay, Mama, I don't need your life story. Just let me upgrade my stuff. Oh, my God. Not Big Bertha. <laughs> Godspeed. Oh, please. You never know what you're gonna run into out there. Godspeed. Fucking nerd. <laughs> well... Cloud served in the war. He served. Are you ready to serve? Careful yes. <laughs> um, no, let's not change yours. No, go back, please. Yes, sister, please. It will still make me itch bowl knowing that I've been on an army barrack and drag is so funny. 
like not even that long ago it was literally last year well this year well last year no it was last year it was not this year It was. <laughs> okay. Let's see what's on the other side. My skin is so itchy today. Like, why? Finally, I can use some fresh air. Over. I still can't believe this happened. Uh oh. Dang, Nima Dodes. You just need to walk a little bit longer, that's all. What is this button? Oh. I haven't made emojis for. My soundboard yet, so I was just experimenting with sound effects. Again. That one was a lot closer. Hello. Is there anyone out there that needs some help? A lot of money saved up. My. Just a little more. Come on. Come on. It won't budge. Make room. Mara, you're alive. With me. I need Ready? that wig. <laughs> that gray wig with that little top knot. Like little. Need that. Great job, guys. <sighs> I can't tell you how relieved I am to see you. She is so mugged too. Don't know. She ain't bad. Something, anything to do. Been back to the bar yet? No. Well, no. Maybe you should go take a look. <sighs> okay. First the bar, then the rest. Careful. The roads are a mess. Watch your step or you'll wind up in a hole. I've heard that a few times. Hello! Oh. Anybody out there? If you can hear me, say something! Anybody out there? Hey! Hey! Hello. If you can hear me, shout! Did they ever disclose how many people died in this incident? Can you hear me? Like Can anybody hear ever me? in this franchise ever? I feel like it's hey, important to hey. note. Just three. Tifa. Get back! Ah. Shit! What is that? mean i i r c what does that stand for that's wedges cat what oh baby let's follow it oh ready one i thought it was the two, same thing as tldr three. but but different 
Look at the kitty. Looks like my old roommate's cat. Is this all that's left of Wedge's place? Oh, not this part. I hate this part of the game. Oh my god. I don't even know if I can do this part. It's so boring. Don't even make me play as him right now. Tifa. Cloud! Shout if you can hear me! Hey! I hate you guys. I can't even. I swipe my card every which way and I lose all my pities. I have some saved up for Blade though, so maybe I can get him this time. Why does everybody else get to really succeed, but I fail? Oh wow. No Thank you, Guy Winter, for the 1,000 biddies. That is so generous. I know, can we trade like Pokemon cards? I'll give you some cookies. Everything on my body is itchy. I'm kind of having an issue about it, but I'm just gonna, you know. You really want to throw down with me? Pretend like it's not happening. Uh, see ya. <laughs> and don't come back. <laughs> We're playing through this part. No, literally. <laughs> Like, this is thrilling gameplay. Oh, I went the wrong way. So now I'm wasting more time as this horrible character. I, I just like him not, like, he's just, he's exhibited signs of why I shouldn't like him. So I shouldn't have to explain myself, really. Hello? If you would excuse me. How long it take him to build all this beneath our feet? You ain't getting out of this one. Suck it. Don't stop now. See ya. Oh my god, Mama, can we talk about um, that show on Paramount Plus, Fellow Strangers? The sex scenes in that show get crazy. Oh. Like, I. I'm not complaining, but oh my god, I'm like, oh! Oh! Like, it gets wild. The first episode, they fuck like three times. I'm like, oh my goodness. And like, these gentlemen are definitely not, it, 
it's 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 really happening in real time. Not, probably not the butt fucking, but like you going down. the making One out and done. licking each other's armpits and oh my Ooh. oh my god, mama. Yeah, Suck on this. Time for a serious yeah map bomber, bomber, bomber. Not really sure, but the guy from American Horror Story. Wait, well, he, he played the one of the gay guys on Hotel. Oh yeah, another one in the bag. I'm honestly not sure. I went through the first episode. Well, it's a prequel. The show, like spoiler, it's like the it's like the story of somebody's life. So it takes place in the past. Yeah, very much armpits. Like, not to like go there, but like every fetish under the sun they exhibit on that show. It's like, it's wild. And that's not even like part, I, I haven't watched it, but people say the sex scenes make the show better because there's like a storytelling there about their love because it's like a romance thing which I see I could see it you really wanna throw down with me? cause like sex is like loving and passionate if it's like between two lovers so like I see it suck on this can't you sleep in ain't got nothing on me you really wanna throw down with me like this is like really fun gameplay. Like it's like really fun. And there you have it. Just no escape in the mist there. Womp womp. You really want to throw down with me? Suck on this! Ooh. Ain't no thing! Come on! Suck on this! See ya! Ain't no thing! I'm really gonna enjoy burning it all down. Suck on this! Suck on these nuts. Oh! Oh, I'm so hungry. Hey, Tifa! You okay? Like, girl, I can't. Like, can I swap to Tifa, please? Some food. I don't know. Well, they can take care of himself. We've got bigger issues. It's over. <laughs> oh, my God. Thank you. Are you all right? Yeah, I'm good. Thanks. All right. Gotta go find Wade. Come on. He didn't even say, well, yes. He said, well, yeah. Uh. You ain't getting out of this one. Special oh, delivery. Too late. Let's move, move, move. Not so fast. If 
I gotta climb another damn ladder. Well, girl, get used to it. <laughs> See ya. You're up. I got this. See ya. I'll be fine. Wedge is holding up okay? Of course he is. He's a lot tougher than people think. Probably sleeping soundly, dreaming about his cats. You're right. We should treat him to a nice meal when he gets back. His choice. Come on! Yeah! Give him your How do you pronounce that enemy? Did you see that? Vagahisa Pola Pod. What the? Always a mouthful, I think. Gotta make a stand. Oh my god. Get your ass out of here. Fire in one off. Ain't no thing. Get your ass out of here. Hell yeah. Maybe dial it back a little. Hmm. Gotta stay on my toes if I'm gonna make it out of here alive. Wake that tea up, Tifa. Maybe take it down a little? Get him. Oh, the Where? kitty. He's okay. You sure? Making me worry like that. I'd kick your ass if you didn't look like shit. Thank God. Thank you. Oh my God, the kitty! Okay, let's go. I'm <laughs> right. He's like passed out. She's like, he's he's okay. Oh. Is that so? Yep, it's you, all right. Huh. Baby, it's you. What is this? Barrett! <clears throat> Can't we just leave? Oh, that's <sighs> Tifa. Come on! Oh. God. Fights a demon on the TL. I mean, not far off. I do that often. Where were you three times? Are you I have not played as Barrett here. Ah! Big yawn. The two for one deal. Hey guys. Oh, they just don't stop. 
They have little penises. Did you see that? Look at his aim. Nice reference. Oh, she just gagged that. I can't even get close to it. What am I supposed to do? Just stand here as Tifa? Can Barrett be a big boy and heal himself?
Oh, hey, Cloud. Cloud! Well, time, Merc. You're up. Late to the party and you giving me orders? Okay, are we done? So how'd you manage to track us down? Followed the trail of bullet holes. There's nobody else I know who leave that kind of mess. Oh, gag him. Get him again for me. We need to get him somewhere safe. Everything else can wait until after. No, no kidding. Let's go. Still playing as Barrett. Why can't I play as Tifa carrying the cat? I want you to take Wedge back for me. I'm gonna look around for the others. He made it, didn't he? They could still be alive. Look at the kitty. I saw them both at the pillar. Jesse and Biggs. Saw how bad they were hurt. I'm sorry, but. Don't. They've returned to the planet. Well, sort of, kind of. They, they were supposed to return to us. Hi, Dylan. Thank you. <sighs> but if we stop now, They'll never let us live it down. Well, they're dead, so... So... They'll never live anything down anymore. Why did they make me play as Barrett for 2.5 seconds to carry Wedge, like, 2 centimeters? That was so bizarre. All right, that's I've had I'm done. I'm sorry. 
I truly am. I, I'm, I'm dying. I don't know what place to go and... I would never leave a wounded man out on the street. <clears throat> Elmira, I know what you said, but you have to let us go after Eric. Not this again. We found an underground Shinra lab, where they've done human testing. This wasn't the first time, and it won't be the last. I know these people, and I know they're never going to let Aerith go. She's the last living ancient on the planet. Think about what that means to Shinra scientists. Oh, he's really talking. Especially to that son of a bitch, Hojo. Oh! We're all just numbers and meat Enough. to him. But... <sighs> the most I've heard him talk in one moment. Please. I need some time to think. You've all had a long day. Why don't you go upstairs and get some rest? Yeah, that's a great idea. Okay. Oh, God. No save point? Okay, great. It's your holiday sign, buddy. Oh, perfect. Oh, Jesus fucking Christ. <laughs> Had enough. Yeah, we have four more chapters. We're fine. We're fine. We're fine. We'll definitely get that done next time. Quickly, I'm gonna 